Hello, first graders. Um, it's Miss Jane again to uh, teach you some lessons on spelling. Are you ready to begin? All right. So I am sure all of you um, worked on your worksheet yesterday about short O and long O sound. So I wanted to just review. Um, those two sounds together and continue to talk about them. Okay, so why don't we read these words together? I want you to repeat after me from the very beginning. Here you go. Soon. Good. Luck. Talk, food, buck, zoo, foot, cool, noon. And as always, we have two high frequency words. Repeat after me. Many. He. And I am very sorry, first graders. I forgot to give you challenge words yesterday. So I have them here for you. Um, let me pull it up. Okay. So here you go. These two words are going to be the challenge words for um, unit 24. So let's go ahead and write these two words down under um, the challenge words in the blank. So the first one is Baruch. Oh, ooh. We just talked about it in our Bible story. Small stream, small lake, Baruch. The second one is wood, wood, right. Okay, so short O and long O sound. Hmm. Okay, so short O sounds like this. Uh, uh. Book. And let's do another one here. Um, book and foot. Another one can be luck. Uh, luck. Right? We put after me again. Book. Foot, look. Okay, and long O sounds like this. Ooh, zoo, soon, and food. So again, short O, uh, uh, long O, ooh, ooh, yeah, okay, um, so now I just wanted to check the answers for um, the assignment that was given for yesterday, um, so let's just go over the answers here together. So you have to sort the words um, by short O sound or long O sound. Okay. So the first word here, soon. Ooh. Yeah, long O. Soon, long O. What about good? G, uh, d. So, uh. So it's short O. Look. Uh. Again, short, tuck, 
short, yes. Food, oo, long. Buck, a, uh, short. Zoo, oo, long. Foot, a, uh, short. Cool, oo, long. Noon, again, long. Everyone got them? All right. Now we are going to move on to the next page. Hmm. We have some animal homes in the picture here. Um, let me pull up the slide. Hmm. Okay, so let's, let's talk briefly about this. Where do animals live? Um, so what animals do you think um, would choose to live in the woods? What animals do you think would choose to live in the woods? All right, some wild animals, right? Be bears. Um, oh, deer, yeah. Okay, chipmunks. Mm -hmm. Rabbits. Yeah, of course. Okay, so those are some animals um, that would choose to live in the wood. What? Ud. Is it short or long? Ding, ding, ding. Short O. Next. Everyone repeat after me. Cocoon. 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 Is it short or long? Ding, ding, ding. Long O. So what animals do you think would choose to live in a cocoon? Right. I hear some of you guys um, shouting the answers out because you're so excited to answer Miss Jen. So we have some, some, not all, but some butterflies and moth. Yeah. So that's cocoon. And next we have brook. Oh, yes. This is um, a place where God provided water for Elijah, right? When he was hiding from King Ahab. Um, so brook. What animals would choose to live here? Um, yes, you are correct. My computer is not working. Oh no. Um I'm not sure if you guys can see the screen, but I can't all of a sudden for some reason. Uh, give me give me a moment here. Oh, okay, I'm back. Oh my goodness, I'm sorry about that, you guys. Um, all right, where were we? Right, so that's broke. And now moving on to pull. All right, what animals um, might choose to live here? 
Yeah, right. Um, I think some reptiles like turtles、um, or snakes might choose to live in a pool, right? And so we are going to go back to our work text here. We are going to be writing some. Oh, you guys can't really see this. Okay.、Um, you guys are going to be writing each rhyming word for the animal homes. Okay. So you see,、uh, we have wood over here.、Uh, and what would be the rhyming word for wood? And what is a rhyming word? Rhyming word should have the same, same vowel sound and ending sound. So, to find a rhyming word for wood, you need to look for a word that has short O sound with,、um, with ending sound D. Short O plus D.、Hmm. Let's go over the list over here. Short O with D. Yeah, you are correct. Good. It's not food because foo ood、um, has long o sound. So good would be the rhyming word for wood. So let's write it down. Good. There you go. And number two, cocoon. Hmm, we have two rhyming words、um, for a cocoon. And you would need to look for. Long O sound with an at the end. Let's find it. Oh, I already see one right there. Soon, cocoon, soon, and words that ends with an. Oh, we just have one more right here. Noon. So you would be writing soon, noon, cocoon. Now, up next, Brooke. Oh, look at that. Brooke has three rhyming words on the list. Brooke. So you would need to look for short O sound with K at the end. There you go. Look, tuck, and buck.、Mm. Write them down over here. And pull. You would need long O sound, yes, with L at the end. Right over here. Cool. Pull. Cool. All right. And at the bottom of this work text, it says you would need to color words with short O, orange. Color words with long O, blue.、Mm, okay. So we have sort out,、um, sort the words by short O and long O sound on the first page. So you can refer to the list here to color、um, short O, orange, long O, blue, and see what you get. Some of you probably already know what you're gonna be getting. Yeah, it looks like it's gonna be、um, Nemo from the Finding Nemo, right? Okay, well, have fun coloring. Make sure to color orange with short O and blue for long O sound. Okay, and that will be all for today's spelling class. Hope you guys have a great day today, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.